Gentlemen, gather round. The competition is about to begin. This is the funniest citizen of Hollywood competition live here on Sunset Boulevard. Ladies and gentlemen, we have three competitors today. The gorgeous Miss Evie Starlight. The stunning Mr. Wink Wright. Remain seated. Remain seated. And me, my name is Jack Diamond, local Hollywood talent agent. Welcome to today's competition. How's everybody doing today? Well, gosh, you guys are looking great. Welcome, everyone, to the Funniest Citizen Hollywood competition. It's an honor to have you here today. Um, your job is really simple during today's competition. When you hear this sound, all you have to do is applaud, scream, holler, and cheer. Let's practice this now. Funny joke. Okay, some of you people had no reaction whatsoever. This is not TV. We can see you, people. See you, yes. see you. So we'll try that one more time. The very funny joke! Yeah! There you go, now you're doing it right, okay. Now what's gonna happen is uh, we're gonna do a competition here, a comedy competition. We're gonna tell jokes. Um, we uh, told last week was knock-knock jokes. Close your night. Close your night. And the week before that was the um, chicken cross the road jokes. <laughs> yes, but today's jokes, ladies and gentlemen, are jokes in the formula of 99. Oh, I don't know 99 jokes. No, not the number. No, 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 it's not a number, it's a formula. Let me show you, I'll give you an example. Science? Go to I didn't know that right science. Howdy, sir, what's your name, where you from? Uh, Jake from Frederick, Maryland. This is a Jake from Frederick, Maryland. Hi, a Jake. A Jake, um, do you have a, you live in a place that has a junk drawer there in Maryland? Yes. Could you name an object in your junk drawer, please? I think that's the one thing everybody has in time. Everybody's got a junk drawer. Battery. Most likely, yes. Yeah. Batteries. Batteries. So if battery was the object, they would say 99 batteries walk into a bar. The bartender says, I'm sorry, but we don't serve you batteries in here. And the batteries say, are you positive? Oh. <laughs> See? Okay, give us another object. Give us another object. Paperclip. Evie, make paperclip funny. Okay, okay, okay. 99 paperclips. So we'll have to do that. And the bartender says, hey, you paperclips. I'm not serving you in here. <laughs> One more object for Mr. Winkwright. Staples. Staples. Well, staples. Keep it together. <laughs> Thank you. That was really good. I used it again because it was so funny the first time. It's really good. Can you come up with really another good. one? Okay. Really good. Yeah, you have got another one? I did, but keep it together. Yeah, but that was yeah. hers, so you got to come up with one of your own. Oh, it's a rule? We can't use the same joke? No, it's no, it's a rule. Even if it's real funny? No, no, it's a rule. You you tell can't. Milton Burl that. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 One guy. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody else over 40. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, Stapler, thank you for that suggestion. It's Woo! all up here. I'm going to run it around, see what comes out this end. <laughs> Nobody wants to see what comes out no. the other end. No. <laughs> no. Uh, 99 of Staplers walk into the bar, and the bartender says, I'm not serving you Staplers in here today, so get out. And the same place said, is it because we can't keep it together? <laughs> still the same joke. It's still the same joke. Okay, don't worry about it. Don't worry I'm gonna about get it. it though. I'm gonna well, get what it. we do is we need some help today. We do need somebody who would like to come here and be our official scorekeeper. So, uh, oh, there's many people. How about the gentleman? Right there? Yeah. The gentleman. Okay. The young yeah. Hello, sir. Okay. What is your name and where do you hail from? Michael from Pittsburgh. This is Michael from Pittsburgh. Okay, now stop that. Yesterday was Josh. All right, Michael, what do you what do you what do you do there in Pittsburgh? Uh, right now I live here now, but I'm from Pittsburgh. Oh, and what do you do here? Uh, I work at a ride. So mysterious. Oh, so mysterious. Very like, attractive. Like, like he gives rides. It's like he works for the mafia or something, you know? Or you take a ride, but you just never come back. It's a family business. There you go. Here's a chalk. All right, whenever we're going to do another object, okay? But this time we have to make it more difficult. So we're going to get one object, and we all three have to tell a joke about that same object. Okay. 
Okay, and you will have to decide who is the funniest. Got it. By the applause of our Is he going to be fair and just in this? I mean, let's, we're twins, you know, so just keep that in mind, right? The twins, yeah. The twins. Okay. I'll get another object. I'm going to go here to this lovely lady. Hi, ma'am. What's your name? Carol. This is Carol, everyone. Where are you from? Uh, Orlando, Florida. Oh, Orlando! That's where I want to go when I retire. Very nice. Are you retired? Almost. Well, you got there too early then. Well, you should have waited. Everybody goes there when they retire. Let me ask you a question. Uh, what do you do for a living? I uh, raise children. Oh, okay. What is an object you use in your line of work when you're raising children every day? A frying pan. A frying pan? Ah! Okay, well, let's see. We're going to have to... I'm going to have to child, call child services or something. Wow. Isn't it? <laughs> with a, with a right. spatula or something. Maybe a ruler. But no. Right. Wow. Everybody should make fun of her. They're scared of her. Now. I'll be your bodyguard. Oh, you oh, that's nice of you, sir. We appreciate that. Okay, frying pan. Frying pan. Why don't somebody make up a joke okay. about a frying pan? Okay. Okay. So, 99 frying pans walk into the bar, right? And the bartender said, keep it together. <laughs> Okay, okay, I got another one. I got another one. Okay. Uh, nine frying pans came into the bar, and the bartender said, Not too many frying pans in here. You know what? You are the most attractive frying pans that have ever walked in here. I'm going to serve your handsome, your suave, your such good looking frying pans. And the frying pan said, Stop trying to butter us up. Yeah. There you go. Did you put <laughs> Unless you got that spray stuff. Okay, 99. This thing of a joke about Pam. It's okay. So, 99 <laughs> frying pans walk into a bar, and the bartender said, I'm sorry, we don't serve you frying pans in here. And they said, that just burns us up. Oh. 99 cast iron skillet frying pans. Wow. wow. In front of the cell. <laughs> This is not. Uh, this is just kind of a test run. Who do you feel was the funniest during that round? Okay, people were voting for their jokes. Okay. Uh, what do you think? How do you feel? I feel pretty good. In my head. And who do you think would have won? I was gonna say you, Jack. Well, that well, that's very nice of you. It's very nice of you. And would it? But that was just a practice round. Now, <clears throat> the true competition begins. Now! Are you ready, oh. Evie? Why don't you get us an object this time? I'm going to get you an object. You tell her to get an object, she's going to come back with a man. I can't do a fantastic hair. What's your name? No. I know. I know. I'm curious. When you get home from school, what is the first thing you want to do for fun? Eat a snack. What's your favorite snack? Brownies. You think we can make brownies for me? Sure. 99 brownies walk into a bar. The bartender said, Sorry, we don't serve you brownies in here. He said, Why not? He said, You're already baked. Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, brownies walked into the bar, you see, and uh, <laughs> the, bar, the bartender said, Oh, hey, there's an awful lot of you brownies in here. And they said, We just came back from the Brownie World series, so batter up. I don't know. Yeah! Right. Keep it together. Keep it together. Brownies. Okay. Uh, 99 brownies walked into a bar. The bartender said, Hey, you brownies, I'm not serving you in here. The brownies said, No, no, we're not here to drink. We're looking for our friends. They deserted us. Oh. Okay, now this is your moment. That was a real round. You have to judge. You have to give somebody a mark. Who is it going to be? Uh, TV, yes. Congratulations, Miss Star. Wonderful. This let's do, let's do one off, more right? round. Let's do one more round like that. Uh, why don't you get us a, an object, Mr. Wright? Here's one. Okay, no, 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 no. no. An object for the joke. Yes, that's no. an object. That is an individual. It's a person. Okay. It's your sister. I'm going to ask this guy. This guy. What's your name? Lawrence from Orlando. Hi, Lawrence from Orlando. You bet, probably don't find that on the keychain, do you? Lawrence yeah. from Orlando. Yeah. Probably just go with Lawrence, probably. Yeah, go. <laughs> Lawrence, what? Um, you got this New York, what is that? New York what? New York football giants. New York football giants. Uh -huh. They actually play in New Jersey. You know what I mean? Right. I don't know if you knew that. I'm very sports-oriented. I know you are. Thanks. <laughs> 
They're putting New Jersey. You know why people in New Jersey are so depressed? Why? The light at the end of the tunnel is New York. <laughs> you know why they call New Jersey the Garden State? Because you're always guarding your keys, guarding your wallet. Right? <laughs> Welcome to New Jersey. It's only stay with the state smell. Really? Actually. But, okay, so, I, it says got football on it. So you like football? Yeah. Who doesn't? I have no idea. Okay. So, let's do football. Okay. You got football? Football. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> 99 footballs walked into the bar. That's very good. I mean, you know, I hope they covered the kids. We're going to have to explain it, and we're not paying they gotta learn sometime. <laughs> 99 footballs walked into the bar, and the bartender said, um, Oh, gee, remember, I'm not serving you footballs in here tonight. It's singles night, and there's 99 of you, and the football said, We're just here hoping to score! Uh, New England footballs walk into a bar. The bartender said, I'm sorry, we don't serve you New England footballs in here. So they left deflated. <laughs> okay. I think we know who got that point. He's so silly. Of course he's going to like that one. <laughs> All right, so now I think we should up the game a little bit. I think we're going to find an object, and this time we have to go through twice. Yes. Don't see staplers. No, we're not going to do staplers. I'm going to go over here. This lovely lady right here. Hi there, what's your name? This is Taylor, everyone. Welcome, Taylor. Where do you hail from? Jolita. California. California, beautiful. You're close here to Hollywood. Where do you live? Northern. Northern. Sacramento, Palo Alto, San Francisco. One country, very nice. Um, let me ask you a question. Uh, what is your favorite hobby, favorite thing you like to do in your spare time? Sing. <laughs> Sing. Sing. Okay. okay. Singing. Singing is the object. Okay. All right. You want me to go? Um, 99. Oh, you want to go? Okay. I, 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 go right ahead. Ask the, ask the singer of the group. Okay. I feel like, you know. You should I'm, go I'm, first. Okay. 99 uh, singers walk into the bar, and the bartender said, I'm not serving you singers in here today, so get out! And they said, why won't you serve us? And they said, well, because I have a feeling you singers are sopranos, and you're nothing but treble. Martin said, hey, how'd you get in here? He said, well, you got to have the right key. Yeah. 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 Their yeah. favorite key is whiskey. Yeah. 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 99 singers, we're doing twice, right? Yeah. Okay. 99 singers walked into the bar, and the bartender said, that's what you see the doing, so get out. And the singers were very offended. They were very hurt feelings. Jack, I don't know if you've ever seen a singer with her feelings. It's not pretty. Not pretty. The bartender said, wow, I guess I struck a chord. Oh! <laughs> Woo! Very good! Woo! You're Very welcome. Good. <laughs> And the bartender said, sorry, we don't serve you singers in here. He said, what? He says, I'm sorry, we don't serve you singers in here. They said, why not? He says, I don't like the way you look. He said, wow, that's so low. <laughs> so there you have it. We both told two. Now you have to. Maybe we should give you a little help. Let's give you a little help. How many of you thought Evie did a nice job doing that? How many of you like Mr. Wink right? Jack Diamond, don't it? Yeah. Oh, 
look at that ring, you got yourself a point. Congratulations. Yay! Yay! Now we're in a three-way tie. Now what do we do? Three-way tie. Okay, you know what now we should do? Uh, speed round. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I'm speed round. Cute. I'm gonna find an answer. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go here and this nice gentleman here. Hello, sir. What's your name? Sean. How are you, Sean? Hi, Where do you hail from, sir? Sarasota. Oh, lovely Sarasota. What do you do for a living there, Sean? Uh, computer stuff. Computers. Oh, okay. Computers. Computers. <laughs> so should we go through three times this time? I thought it was a speed round until somebody can't come up with That's a joke. That's what it should be. So somebody uh, can't come up with a joke. Okay, good. speed round. Okay. All right. Um, uh, 99 computers. Walk into a bar. And the bartender said, I'm sorry, we don't serve you computers in here. They said, uh, we're not here to drink, Mac. We just came in to pee, see? Oh! 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 computers walk into the bar, and the bartender said, uh, no, 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 go serve you computers in here. They said, get out. The computer said, oh, no, we're not here to drink. We just came in to install Windows. Oh! oh! Very Oh. I don't think we even need to go any further after that. Wow. She's in crackers. I mean, I got them, but they're not that good. I think we're going to get that one to Put it up there. Put it up there. Well deserved. So right now we're tied. So we're going to have to have a tiebreak. Okay. Okay. Miss okay. Amy, why don't you whistle? I'm going to go all the way to Now, uh, what's your name? Josh. Hi, Josh. Hi, now, Josh. I'm curious. You've got a lovely beard here. What is an object that would be the most ridiculous thing to think of if someone said, shave out this beard? What is the weirdest object you could possibly use? He's consulting with his lawyers. That's good. Right it's always important. He doesn't want to shave consult. the beard. He asked the woman, what would you shave your beard with? Nice, nice job. Hey, Josh, what are you doing? Josh, what are you doing? I'm hearing a fork! <laughs> oh, okay, fork. Also known as a dingle hopper. Uh, yeah! Fork. I had a dingle hopper. I put some salve on it and it went away. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's salve or ointment, though. Which one is it? I like a good ointment. Oint ointment. Oh. I like a good ointment. 99 forks walk into a bar. The bartender said, I'm sorry, we don't serve you forks in here. He says, why not? He says, we don't like your setting. Ah. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. That's great. Was that yours? It's so good. Okay, yeah. I'm sorry. It's so good. I thought oh, of it. Terry, sorry. <laughs> and then he said it. Okay, no. I did say um, it. Came out of my mouth. <laughs> the bartender said, keep it together. Oh, that was good. Right, well, thank you. Thank thank you. So good. <laughs> I've got another one right here. Like, yeah. it's coming. I can't wait to everybody hears it. They're going to be like, ah! Is there an example of why the citizens of Hollywood are the longest running show on the Unlike the little cabbage today that said the Indiana Jones was the longest running show, false and incorrect. Oh. <laughs> 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 Hashtag, where are the citizens of Hollywood? Yeah. Yeah. Night. Oh, and night. the bartender, 99 of them, so yeah. whew, that was overwhelming probably for everybody involved. <laughs> and the bartender said, you forks, you can't come in here, it's singles night, I'm not serving you forks today. And they said, come on, we were just hoping to spoon. Yeah! Yeah. There you go. That's very good. Okay, it's up to you. We Which one was funny? You, you did, you circled that airport. <laughs> <laughs> we go a week, go away! The last round is going to be very difficult. We're going to get two objects. Two objects. Don't get stay Hi, what's your name? Brett. Brett, what was your favorite uh, subject in school? Recess. 
That's not a subject. Yeah. Where did you get this a period of time of the day. American public school. History. 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 There's no future in it. Uh -huh. So you know it. History is one of the objects. Go to the other side of the crowd. Go here to this lovely lady. Hello, ma'am. How are you and where are you from? Connecticut. Say you're right in your grocery store there in Connecticut. You don't go to the milk and the eggs and, you know, the yogurt section. You don't go to the vegetables and fruit and all that. You go into the middle section. You buy something from the middle of the grocery store. What object are you going to purchase? Oh, you do the grocery shopping. Okay, what object? Steak! In the middle of this... Chips! Chips and history are our objects. So you must make it, must be two objects, they must be in the same joke formula, and they must be funny. Okay? <laughs> well, I can only promise one. Okay. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Ladies, beauty before age. Okay. All right. Um. <laughs> oh, 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 forget me. Go ahead. Yeah, right. Okay. Right. I mean, I, I'm going to be really running around a lot here. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. 99 history chips walk into the bar, and the bartender said, "Not serving your history chips in here every time you come in here. You're ruining the bar. You're awful." And I'm sick of that. And the bartender said, and the bartender said all that. <laughs> and the history <laughs> chips said, "Come on, that was all in the past." Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Okay. <laughs> and then the, the, the history chick said, besides, we don't want to drink here anyway. Just all the flavors to choose from, you had to be salty, bartender. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 